a long time ago, I made another video about this topic. I think it was around the release of World 3. I had not unlocked all of the salt yet, far from it. But more importantly, the refinery mechanics have changed a bit since then. And not only have the game changed since then, I have changed since then. So I would like to make a better version of my old guides, starting with this one. Here is the refinery building. You have your red salt, or red salt, explosive, spontaneous, or just red, orange, blue, green, purple, and black. And this combustion button here is not working. So how does it work? Well, you see the material here. This gets eaten every now and then. You can see the next combustion cycle. This timer ticks down. And the same here next synthetic cycle. These timers are not the same. Here are the different ranks, 13, 10, and 6. Every rank you go up, you need more material. However, you also get more salt. But the scaling is not one-to-one. -one. As your rank goes up, you will pay more material, but only get a bit more salt. But since salt is a big bottleneck in the game, upgrading the rank will save you a lot of time. Here you can see the fuel time, how much material you have at the current consumption. So you don't have to do any math. 11 days and empty and nine minutes you see here there is a auto refine at zero and if we look here i can change it to 10 25 50 75 90 and zero if it is at zero that means you can rank it up you are seeing a video of me clicking the rank up button right now it is pretty simple just click the button you get a bunch of materials and you can deposit it to the storage chest so what happens when you don't have it at zero well this is what happens it auto refined let's have it at 50 percent i don't need more ranks in this i think at least i hope so and here you can see five four three two one bam and you can see here amount of sand just went down they took that from the storage on their own so while you don't have to micro the material as long as you have plenty of it i highly recommend you 3d print this material if you want to rank up something you have to put it at zero and then manually click rank up otherwise it will get stuck at 100k and then it will just sit there and do nothing and what is salt used for well tons of things actually but you can see here this one needs salt this needs salt this needs salt, salt, everything wants salt, more salt, and more salt. It is also used for crafting and a few other things. I'm not going to show you every use of it, but here is some other salt lick, red, orange, blue, green, purple. I guess I can mention this, 10% refinery speed for all cycle types. In other words, cycles take less time. So you spent orange salt to upgrade this and you get 2% each time. A while ago, we got the new merit item here, the world three merit. Refinery salt costs don't scale beyond power output. You can see here in the image I posted that. So before this upgrade, everything used the cost multiplier. But with this upgrade, the salt instead uses the power cycle. So at rank three, it's five times cost multiplier, but only four times power cycle multiplier. That means you use less salt. Everything needs salt to produce salt, except the first red one. You don't really have to think about this, just buy it. It's always good to have. Salt used to be a massive bottleneck, but after World 4 came out, we got this here, Gilded Cyclical Tubing. All refinery cycles occur three times faster. Faster cycles means more salt. This meant we got three times more salt. Of course, the material cost also went up, but now we no longer have to sit around and wait for salt all day. And of course, crafting also cost a lot of salt. You can see here this void helmet cost 500 blue salt. The squire have special abilities that uses the salt. Like here we get build speed in the construction depending on how much red salt we have stored. I only have 14 right now so my bonus is pretty damn small. But they also have this skill, refinery throttle, automatically trigger 19 refinery cycles. Still cost materials though. Do note that the 19 is depending on how much you have leveled this skill up. And it's a skill with a really long cooldown. So you can use this skill once per day. And I think that's it for the refinery. How should you level them up? 
Well, as you can see, our 13, 10, and 6. I think my explosive is a bit too high. You should always rank up the red salt because everything needs the red salt, but these guys are a bit, they're not as straightforward. Of course, if you have the material, it's pretty much always the good thing to do it, but yeah, it can get pretty expensive pretty quick. And if your purple salt eats up all your green salt, for example, and you need green salt for a specific item, then you're gonna have a bad day. You can see the member who did needs 400 green salt and the mark of member needs another 400 green salt and the anvil time needs 400 the refiner cycle is this timer up here i hope this refinery video is a bit better than the last one thank you for watching and i will see you in the next one bye bye